Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Trey, and I want to talk about Justice League. No, Suicide Squad kills the Justice League, and how I am not impressed. I am not impressed nor excited about it. That that little gameplay teaser bullshit. Yeah, no, no, I, I, I'm still not feeling it. I don't know what the hell y'all was thinking. And you talking about this is in the the same universe as Arkham? Yeah. <laughs> Gotham Knights seem more accurate to that than um, Justice, I mean, Suicide Squad killed Justice League. Why couldn't it be Suicide Squad versus Justice League? If, if anything, you know what I'm saying? Like, come on now. Let's let's stop playing the yo-yo with me and, and give me something better than this. It's already bad enough. Dead shot looks completely different. You can't say this is tied into Arkham and then try to be like, oh, because, you know, Will Smith was Will Smith was um doing the uh, Will Smith was um death death shot in the movie, so we need to make him black in the video game. No, that doesn't make sense. We already seen what Death Shot looked like in the Arkham franchise. How he go from white to black? It makes the it makes no logical sense. That ain't no that ain't no error you can just ignore. You know, y'all be doing dumb shit for diversity and inclusion. My ass. How many black characters have been on the Suicide Squad? Several. Several. So why you didn't just use them instead? I'm sorry. This doesn't even look good. And I really don't want to see the Justice League. The first time the Justice League appears in the Arkhamverse. I don't want to see them being killed off or being hurt so bad or whatever. Like, that's crazy as hell. Like, that's crazy as hell. That, oh yeah, the first time we see Superman, he's laser beaming somebody to death because reasons. And Amanda Waller like, killed the Justice League. What the fuck? <laughs> like, did you guys not even think this plan through? This is what I'm talking about, Warner. Why the hell would you approve of something like that? The Suicide Squad should be doing something else. Not killing the Justice League. It's like you couldn't even come up with a better concept because no, this is actually this concept is lazy as hell. I don't care what none of y'all say, lazy as hell concept. That's what it is because that's all it is. It's a lazy concept that we've seen. We've already seen evil Superman stuff. We already seen evil Justice League. Hell, we got injustice for that. If I want to watch. I mean, if I want to play a video game about evil Justice League people, then I'll play Injustice. I don't need to see the Suicide Squad killing them. I'm sorry. This trailer didn't do anything for me. If anything, it made me aggravated that you guys think it's cute to take a group of villains and tell them, hey, go kill the Justice League. And the only reason why they're doing it is because the Justice League's been hypnotized by Brainiac. Come on now. Come on, somebody. That don't, that don't even make no damn logical sense. That don't make the sense God gave. But it is what it is. I mean, hey, you guys do you, but I, I'm just saying I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed. Not First off, the, the it's only four of them. That's it? Oh, okay. I mean, I would love to have a, you know, two more characters. If you're going to at least go there, at least get put two characters in there. You know, make it a Final Fantasy type kind of game or something. I don't know. I just don't feel exciting or enthusiastic to um, be like, oh, yeah. Wouldn't it be cool if I played a video game where I have to kill the Justice League? Because reasons. I don't know. I, I just was not. I'm not. I'm not a happy camper at all about it. I feel like it's just a knockoff of Suicide Squad versus Justice League, which it, Suicide Squad versus Justice League is not a bad concept at all. But, you know, having the Suicide Squad kill the Justice League, and this supposed to be the first time we've seen the Justice League in the Arkhamverse, yeah, I'm sorry. I, this, this ain't the business. This is the wrong move, the wrong choice for um, the next game outside of Batman. And it's kind of still tied to Batman because you got Harley Quinn in there. Because that makes that makes sense. I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, of course, Harley Quinn should be in there. But you got 
two you got two Batman villains and one Flash villain and a Superboy villain. Yes, King Shark is is originally Superboy's villain, Connor Kent. Not Aquaman's and not the Flash. So yeah. Just letting y'all know that. And it's still tied into Batman. And then how is it gonna pick up? It's gonna pick up um right after the events of of um Arkham Knight. You know what I'm saying? You know, I, I I'm just saying, I'm just saying I'm like I'm more confused on what this video game's trying to be and what it's trying to connect to because that's more of my issue really. So yeah. I mean Okay, so the basic premise is Brainiac is taking over Metropolis and he kidnap he brain controls the Justice League and Amanda Waller is sending in the Suicide Squad to kill the Justice League and stop Brainiac by whatever necessary means. Okay, sure. In theory it could it could be a cool comic book, but like video game wise, yeah, not really. I mean <laughs> From what I saw, I just, I wasn't impressed, you know, I know I'm repeating myself, but I, I truly wasn't impressed with what I saw because it just kind of felt like some half-ass game that I, and I'm like, oh, that's it. It's a, it's basically a, a half-ass shooter game mm -hmm. to me, but it looks good. It's just looks man to me. So I don't know. I, I I'm not. I'm not going to say don't buy the game or anything. We'll have to wait and see, but I'm still not feeling anything from it. And that's what I want to feel. And I hate when they have video games that come out and I don't feel much of anything for it. And then it's just like, uh, I do I want to waste money on it? Because <laughs> I'm not wasting money on video games anymore, especially when they got too many day one patches and everything else under the sun, you know? Or this game needs a big old patch in order for it to work. Uh, nah, you can miss me with all that. I'll just wait until the game's fully fully finished, you know? And then we'll see from there. Or I'll watch somebody play the video game and let me see if that's something that I might want to play, you know? So, yeah. Uh, Suicide Squad killed the Justice League. I know this is kind of really much of a short video, guys. I really don't have much to say is that I'm just not impressed. I just feel, I just feel like I would have preferred them going to like maybe an island or something like that or infiltrating a, a foreign country and have that foreign country as like this open world kind of thing for them. That way you can use each Suicide Squad member's skill to do certain tasks. You know what I'm saying? And what you sh what you could have did is you could have had gave us a few playable characters that you knew you were going to kill off. That way, it kind of still goes with the whole Suicide Squad thing. Especially when Amanda Waller at the end of Batman um, Arkham Origins Blackgate picked up a few people for the Suicide Squad, and it never, you know, it never went on went to anything. Like, where's Deathstroke and what's where's Bronze Tiger at? For God's sakes, if you want to really talk about something, those would be some cool characters to really see that Amanda Waller has. That's all I'm saying, you know. That probably would have been a better game where you have Suicide Squad and just, you just call it the Suicide Squad and that's really it. And then you have them enter, a, 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 like I said, a, a country to retrieve something. And be it can be whatever you guys want it to be. And just make sure that... Just make sure that we're being able to show all of these all of these character skill sets. And good gameplay-wise. Like, I, want to, I wanted to see a Batman Arkham kind of game more than Splatoon for the Suicide Squad. But that's just my, my thoughts and opinion on it. But, yeah, it is what it is. Um, we'll have to see... Again, still not pleased with what I'm seeing. I think it looks terrible, but that's just my thoughts and my opinions on it. You tell me what you guys think in the comments below. Are you guys excited about the Suicide Squad game, Suicide Squad Kill Just League, or are you not? 
let me know and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.